Okay, so it started raining outside, so I've decided to do this in the uh, MOT bay. Not the best, but uh, let's see if I can get round it so you can just have a good look at it. I might have to redo this on another day. But let's see, it's all been cleaned and it started raining. So I can actually turn this into an inspection video now. I'll just do the underneath as well. So you'll see it as I see it. <clears throat> I'll just add the link to the bottom of the description. I'll leave the one that's on there as well. And uh, just, no, it's all open. You can see it's just like caught it just as I started videoing. I decided to bring it in instead. You've seen all the seats already. There's lights in there as well. LED lighting. And um, all the seats operate from there as well. And they operate from here as well, or is that? There you go, there. And you can tilt the seats there as well. Right, you've seen the boot in the other one. So we'll go underneath and do a quick inspection on here. Got the uh, spare tire there. I think that might be a proper full size one. Yeah, it is. 20 inch, so it's got a proper full size spare wheel on there. Air suspension, these are fairly straightforward actually. That one's actually marked it offside rear, which is good. Inside rear. Okay, tyres are all good. I'll have a little bit further down over here, let's have a. Yeah, it's all fairly all good there. Just all the way down there. Brakes are all good. I see nothing wrong there, so look at that. That tyre is good as well. No leaks with it to worry about. We'll probably end up doing a service on this, but I'll give the option to whoever has it. They might want to go and have a full Land Rover service history. But it's not due for a little while yet. It's not done the mileage. It was at a service at 61. Now he's over 21,000. You can see it's been looked after. All, all good underneath. Some bits and bobs. There you go. You never see that before, you? Yeah. That's a part of gearbox. And um, yeah, nothing for me to worry about here. This is all fairly straightforward. Even got the label on the drive shafts. That's your diff. And that tyre, you can see, it's never been used as brand spanking new. Like I say, I think it probably has got the same alloy. So it's got a full alloy of what you've got on there anyway. And the tyres are all immaculate. So there's your tow bar. You can unlock it and then you can take that off and um, put it away. You don't need to keep it out, but obviously you need to keep it out for protection. Protect the rear bumper. There we go. So we'll just finish up on the on the front end. Really quite a very smooth, spacious vehicle. Um, if I still own it, I might use it for my holiday. Probably a bit too nice to leave in an airport car park. But there it is.